This guy is moving to, 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 to foment hate. A president. Buddy, you should be moving to a fucking retirement home. That's where you should be moving to. He's talking about moving. Holy, Holy shit. shit. His brain cells don't even move. He doesn't even move. His lips move, but his brain doesn't move with it. Well, 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 what's going on today, guys? We're back here again with another bumbling Joe Biden, Mr. President fucking cringe. The president of cringe. Joe Biden's most awkward gas of all time. Part two, part two on a never ending list, I'm sure. <laughs> if you've seen uh, this guy speak at all for about five and a half seconds, you would know for sure. This is my on demand news, and I'm going to have that in the description down below because that's what brings us all of this glory for us to react to. So. We're going to just dive right in here, and uh, if you followed his incompetence before and you're enjoying this, uh, please subscribe. This is the road to 100 subs for me. I really appreciate everything you guys give when you smash the like and we do all that fun stuff. So let's get into Bumbling Joe. We hold these truths to be self-evident. All men and women created by the goal, you know the, you know the thing. I'm <laughs> qualified people. I'm the best qualified people person for this job. I'm beginning to see why your wife left you. Oh! <laughs> oh, that one's Savage Zinger. I don't think he even knew that he was insulting the guy, obviously, so that doesn't even count as being savage on his part. Clap for that, you stupid bastard. Wait, 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 you're getting nervous, man. COVID has taken this year, just since the outbreak, has taken more than 100 years. Look, here's the lives... It's just, it's a, when you think about it. You know, the rapidly rising uh, um, uh, in with, uh, with uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, I just spoke at, a, at Dartmouth on health care at the medical school, or not, I guess I wasn't actually on the campus, but the people from the medical school were at the, I, I want to be clear. I'm not going nuts. I'm not sure whether it was a medical school or where the hell I spoke, but it was on a camp. Not going nuts, but you dance off the subject like you're in fucking river dance. I propose, and I'm going to digress slightly. I, here we, we're in a situation. I, the president asked me to head up a cancer moonshine. Another. A cancer moonshine. You drink the moonshine, you feel drunk, and the cancer just goes away. Catch me outside. How about that? Tree. Annexed a significant portion of it called Crimea. Right. He's saying that it was President, my boss, it was his fault. In Guatemala, El Salvador, and and it, to, to, to win and say in Honduras and say, look, I took on uh, Putin in terms of uh, Iraq. I mean, excuse me, in terms of uh, uh, um, what was going on in Ukraine. By strengthening, by strengthening, by strengthening, by investing. $100 billion in education. How many brain cells are left for this guy? This is unbelievable. I cannot even believe they put this shit on TV. Like, no wonder. No wonder Mike Judge had to take a break there for a second because of fucking after he filmed Idiocracy, he kind of realized, oh shit, this is where part of the world is going. Listen, I'm not here to say, like everybody else says, always about like, oh, how the world's all going to shit and everyone's becoming stupid. But a vast majority of people, or not a vast majority, but a large quantity, let's say, okay, of people are becoming very, let's say, dumb. Dumb. And this is like of the dumbest of the dumb when you're fucking trying to lead the free world. And uh, this is who you have in charge. Like, this is the best you have to pick from. Dude, this is like when you go into the grocery store, right? And you pick that, like, you got a whole fucking selection of fresh tomatoes, right? You got the beef steak, you got the Roma, you got all that fresh, fresh tomatoes. And you're going to pick the one that's fucking beaten and bruised and leaking out of the side with brown stains. Nope, that's the one we're going to go with. That's the one. It's between this one and the bruised apple. We're going to pick between these. Get out of here. It's absolutely ridiculous. In global warming efforts, it's a whole bunch of things. We can't afford it by just eliminating, beginning to treat, treat work, reward work as much as well. They get hot. I got a lot of, I got hairy legs that turn, that, 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 that turn uh, um, blonde in the sun. And the kids used to come up and reach in the pool and rub my leg down so it was straight and then watch the hair. It's already creepy enough, man, that this guy's like, you know, holding children too close and literally fucking petting them all awkwardly. And he's being, he's so gross and awkward towards like, you know, the minors. And it's just, 
now he's just on one of his fucking long, outstanding gaffes, flowing through it like the turd down the drain, you know? He's talking about yanking and petting his leg? What the fuck? Good news is, for me, I'm here. The bad news for you is, I'm coming back. I'm coming back. And I want to see these beautiful young ladies. I want to see them dancing when they're four years older, too. Come, come back up again. If you want to protect yourself, get a double barrel shotgun. Oh! Have the shells of 12 gauge shotgun. I like how he says this right after he's talking about how guns are the epidemic of America. Like, this guy can't even get a shit in order. Don't jump! Don't jump! Don't jump! They look at it. So I learned about roaches. I learned about kids jumping on my lap. And I've loved kids jumping on my lap. To say that. Oh, why is that not a soundbite? <laughs> I love kids jumping on my lap. It's like the fucking slap chop guy. You're gonna love my nuts, right? But I love kids jumping on my lap. Like I swear to God, Joe Biden could be like, he's like the dude in the crowd of people that you just kind of do whatever you can to avoid. You kind of <laughs> <laughs> smile and nod whenever, fake laugh whenever he's talking and making a terrible joke. <laughs> and it's even worse now because he's a high authority figure and he's here around those yes men. So it's so fucked. LGBTQT people have no holy LGBTQ has a right to raise a hand to a woman in anger. We have to just change the culture, period, and keep punching at it and punching at it and punching at it. It will be a big per no. I really mean it. Maybe not the right usage of words there, Jumbo Dumbo Joe. And immediately change the law in the state of Delaware, protecting transgender people. Transgender, but the funding gap that exists between minority white and majority white and, and non-white districts. We have this notion that somehow if you're poor, you cannot do it. Poor kids are just as bright and just as talented as white kids. <laughs> Just let Michelle know I did drink this, right? Same time next week? Same time next week. All right. Got a real dilemma, Mr. President. I can't go every day, can I? Hey, what's you like better, these or these? Joe, they're the same. They capture different moods. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. I get a chance to flash shift in a second. I was afraid I'd go through those guys. <laughs> I've seen that as a clip before. That's so funny. So funny seeing that as a, those in memes. <laughs> and he did. I said, no. I said, if we were in high God damn, eh? In the gym and beat the hell out of him. Corruption? Trump was out there tweeting again this morning. I called him President Tweety. Well, Trump is pursuing, pr pursuing a damaging and erratic trade war without any strategy, by the way. This guy is moving to, 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 to form and hate. A president... Buddy, you should be moving to a fucking retirement home. That's where you should be moving to. He's talking about moving. Oh, Holy shit. shit. His brain cells don't even move. He doesn't even move. His lips move, but his brain doesn't move with it. He doesn't know what the hell he's talking about. <laughs> like he's eating fucking baby food. Spitting it out. Oh, my God. What's going on? Trump and the demagogues around, demagogues around the world. But if Donald Trump, if Donald Trump is reelected... He doesn't want to shed light. He wants to generate heat. And he's stroking violence in our cities. <laughs> oh, he, he, he is not my president. I got a prime minister. I'm from Canada. I'm Canadian. I'm from Canada. That's what's going on there. I feel, I feel for my American brothers and sisters. I feel for the love there. I feel with all that love for all the bullshit they got to deal with with those fucking elections and gerrymandering and lobbying and all of that unnecessary. Holy. That shit. The shit over here stinks just as much as the shit over there, though, so. <laughs> Don't have it much better, but fucking. 
Bumbling Joe, Bumbling Joe Biden over here, fumbling over his words, man. I've, he fumbles more words than football players do in a whole NFL season. I like it's unbelievable. This guy, this guy, just oh my god, fuck, man. I'm not even sure I can roll my eyes fast enough before he rolls in all the controversy of his bullshit speak or lack thereof. And it's just so amazing the media just like portrays this and they they don't mention. They don't mention all of the uh, the side shit, you know. They don't they don't they don't mention all of the the stuff that's making him slow or whatever. They're, they're playing him up like he's a normal president. He's not, you know. You're gonna shit on Trump. You should be shitting on fucking Biden just as equally, you know. This guy can't even fucking talk. He can't talk. Like this guy's gonna need a. I'd be surprised if he didn't have a bib when he was eating. <laughs> this guy's gonna need some serious aid sooner rather than later. Nonetheless, this is Bumbling Joe Part Two. I thank you guys there for checking it out. There's going to be at least one more video here coming up soon. Joe Biden part three of like fucking 600 parts here probably by the end of it. <laughs> oh boy. What can you do? What can you do? Not much you can do other than just laugh. Laugh. Thank you for joining me here for this video. And I appreciate you guys watching. So I hope to see you guys in the next ones. And I hope you guys stay real. And I will most definitely stay caveman. So thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Thank you.